In this video recording, I am going to explain the three rules to follow when writing an electron configuration. The first rule is the off-ball principle. Electrons will occupy the lowest energy level orbital that will receive it. So, when we are writing an electron configuration, we need to follow the order specified by off-ball principle. So, first the electron will fill the 1s. S can contain two electrons. And then move on the next one is 2s so if i'm writing an electron configuration i would say 1s2 2s2 then next i always follow the arrow the arrow starts here so my next is 2p now the p can maximum contain six electrons if i have more i continue to 3s2 if i have more i continue to 3p6 4s2 and so on so after 4s2 comes the 3d10 so let's say we have a total of 33 electrons where do we stop so we start filling the orbitals and counting 2 plus 2 equal 4 plus 6 equal 10 12 plus 6 equal 18 plus 2 equal 20 plus 10 equal 30 so I filled now 30 electrons I still I need to fill three more electrons so what comes after 3d is the 4p now we know that p takes six electrons but we only need three so we stop at 4p3 and like this we are doing the electron configuration following the off bow principle let's look at this orbital diagram and we need to see which rule is not obeyed over here the first orbital 1s it contains 1 and then they started filling the 2p uh, the 2s and the 2p however you cannot jump to the 2s before filling the 1s completely so 1s has to be full in order to continue to the 2s so this rule does not obey the off bow principle now the next rule is the Pauli exclusion principle. It says that no two electrons within an atom may have an identical set of all four quantum numbers. And this in other words mean that in an orbital, electrons must have opposite spins. Electrons must have opposite spins. So let's look at this diagram over here. Here I have 1s2, 2s2, each one with opposite spin. But to have here 2s, same spin, this violates of bow principle. So for example, if I am filling or if I have electrons in the 2p, I cannot do this. It has to be opposite. The second electron is always opposite spin to the first one. And the third rule says is Hans rule it says that electrons will occupy will occupy all empty orbitals in a subshell with single electrons having parallel spins before entering the half filled orbitals so you must fill the electrons singly and then you start pairing them so let's say here we have six electrons to fill so we start one two three four we finished the 2s2 now 5 and 6 5 and 6 we cannot complete the first orbital of p by pairing the electrons and this would be incorrect so i'm going to give another example let's say i am filling the d okay i am in d and i'm filling it with saying uh, seven electrons so it would be incorrect if you fill the seven electrons like this, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, that is wrong. You are pairing the electrons. What you need to do is fill the electrons singly and then you pair them. So, so let's say we have seven electrons and this is the correct way to fill the D. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is correct. Thank you.